All right, no more free advice for me this morning. Let's just get to the weather expert standing in a, a giant fogginess. We're in the fog this morning. Here, this is Talladega. Oh, right. That's where that picture was taken. Uh, can't see anything. Uh, a lot of fog out there to start off our day today in Talladega. Visibility there around zero. Same for Jasper area. We just saw the Summerton camera nearby there. Gats and some thicker fog developing as well, too. So be careful of this foggy conditions across central Alabama. No fog downtown. Sunshine, a couple high clouds coming in. That's about it. 73 degrees. Calm winds. Of course, it's very sticky out there. The heat index matching the air temperature so far this morning. Over in Talladega, it is 70, 71. Aniston to Asheville, Springville area, Jasper 72. How about Tuscaloosa, Moundville 75 to start off for morning, 68 in Coleman. Now we'll see these temperatures warming up into the 80s by lunchtime today. And yeah, there's that chance of rain increasing this afternoon, at about 60% or so. And we're going to see the showers and storms firing back up. But not now. Uh, need your sunglasses this morning. How about that? Haven't had to use them very often this week. Have a front to our northeast. This is going to move in kind of backwards. Usually they come in from the west. This is going to impact us more so tomorrow than today, but is going to keep our chance of rain at 60% both days before decreasing to 20% as we get to the weekend. So today you'll see here a couple clouds to start off the day at lunchtime. A few showers and storms. A couple more again hit or miss variety today, but the chance is going to be high. We will see these storms firing back up through dinner time tonight, even on into bedtime tonight. Things are looking pretty good. Tomorrow morning, yeah, starting off with partly cloudy sky. Again, maybe some patchy fall out there and then with that front coming in we will see another round of those showers and storms building back into the area that'll continue through the afternoon hours on Friday kind of tapering off Friday night if you're going out in the town and then heading into Saturday start off with a couple clouds and then notice not much rain in the city the farther east you go you'll see some of that wet weather building back into the area by then so be aware of that as high pressure builds in for Friday and Saturday that means we're gonna be hotter sunnier weather as we get into the upcoming weekend so get ready for some big changes out there this weekend how about this Highs will be in the 90s, but look at the heat index. That top number, yeah, in the 100s. And that's going to be the case into early part of next week as well. So our chance for rain stays fairly low, around 20% through Monday. Up a little bit, though, heading into Tuesday and Wednesday of next week.